Hi, this is a small video regarding ATEM Production Studio 4K. How this device to be connected to your laptop or um, desktop uh, through your internet modem. So basically, you connect your uh, modem, you connect your device, which is the Production Studio 4K through USB and you need to connect the device to your modem through Ethernet cable um, after you set up the software that's coming with the device which is this one this ATM setup you will get this um, picture here so basically you press C you'll get this IP address coming as default from Blackmagic um, device so what you need to know um, as my situation I have my IP address completely different from this one uh, to let this device talk to my computer I need to know what my IP address is so I have to go to he C O M and press enter this is what shows up I put config and press enter oh sorry uh, IP config IP config press enter shows me here what my IP address is what my gateway is so basically, there is two types of IP address um, available, which is at the LAN network, not WAN. WAN is wild area network, which is the other one. But LAN, it's in from the modem to your devices. That's what they're called, LAN. Okay, what I have here, it's 192.168.0.174. That's belong to my computer. And 192.168.0.1 that's belong to my gateway, which is the modem. So I need to change the IP address of my device the same to my network, but different to my laptop computer, which is different to this. So I'll show you now. The other IP address is 10, so basically 10.0.0. .0 .0 one two three for example so I need to do the same thing what I'm doing now so right now um, what we have to do we have to because I have 192 168.0 240 that's fine because the IP address 240 is still okay but don't go over 255 255 is the maximum IP addresses and he we need to change it to zero again so now the gateway the gateway here let's see gateway he which matches gateway he this one don't change it it's a subnet which is its match here never change that and this one should be different from this because this is this is belong to my my um, computer and this one's belong to the IP address belong to the device which is the black magic press save okay now to apply this configuration to the device I need to unplug the power on USB from the network so press the so power USB power Waiting a little bit a while for the device to be connected. Get the power on. 
all right now it's on now after all this being set up there's two way to start I can start from here or I start from here let's start from here there we go it's all done perfect all right now after you set up all these and and you have the control here on that and you came to the point let's close this one close this one and let's see okay you plug your camera for example HD camera with the HDMI cable you have from 1 to 4 and 5 6 7 8 it's a SDI so you plug your camera to one of these ports and you press this button for example button one just you know the camera your camera is working and connect correctly and everything's powered on and you press this button here you hundred percent you choose the port one from the back to put your camera and you see the screen here is black basically this buttons doesn't change from camera to camera it doesn't affect the pre preview but it only shows you if you if port one is working port two is working port three is working that's all all the matter of the screen so basically if you press C one and you, you connect your port uh, your camera to port one and you don't see only black screen and you 100% sure about your camera is connected and powered on and everything's okay with the cable only what you need to do okay in this software you have here if your camera for example if your camera set it up on for example 1080 i 59 or 1080 50 1080 i 50 and your device being set on 1050 ip it's not gonna work it's gonna give you black screen so you need to match that with your camera and this the other thing is to know all the cameras connected to this device need to be the same same thing so if I need to put my camera to 1080 10, 50i uh, or 1080i 50 I need to set all this camera to 1080 80i 50 otherwise it doesn't work so need to be all the same as your camera to be set up and you just bet for example if i am here i just press set change will change and then i can see picture if that the case i will see the picture in here otherwise i'm gonna see it as a black so this is the only thing i can explain to you and the rest of it um, if I find something is difficult and um, you may uh, comments if you have any question I may come um, to it and answer it or make another video regarding other issues which is right now this is one of the issues I find and I was searching in the internet to find what exactly happening with it um, now I have this set it up okay thanks and now everything's working fine with me for this and thank you that's all I